Seven years in San Quentin, three in the hole, McNeil before that. Yeah. McNeil as tough as they say. Why don't you looking to become a penologist? You're looking to go back? I used to chase crews all the time, just looking to fuck up and be thrown back. Well, you must have worked with some dipshit crews. I worked all kinds. You see me doing throw stick and liquor store holdups with born to lose tattooed on my chest? I do not. Right. And I? I'm never going back. Then don't take scores. I do what I do best. I take scores. You do what you be do best. And try to stop guys like me. You never want a regular life? What the fuck is that? Barbecues and ball games? Yeah, that's part of it. That's nice. That's your life. My life? No, that's not my life. My life consists of my wife spending half the night on the couch. I got a fucked up stepdaughter whose real dad is a grade A asshole. And the rest of my time is spent chasing down guys like you. That's my life. A man told me once, you want to make moves, don't keep anything that in your life that you're not willing to walk away from in 30 seconds flat. If you feel the heat around the corner. So if you're chasing me, and you gotta move when I move, how do you expect to keep a family? That's interesting. What are you, a monk? No. I got a woman. Oh, what do you tell her? She thinks I sell swimming pools. So if you see me coming around that corner, what, you're just gonna up and leave without ever saying goodbye? That's the discipline. That seems like it leaves you with a lot of nothing. Yeah, then maybe you and me, we should both go do something else, pal. I'm not much good else. Neither do I. I don't really want to do much else. Neither do I. You know, we're here like a couple regular fellas. You gotta do what you gotta do. I do what I gotta do. But if I'm there and I gotta choose to put you away, I won't like it, but if it's a choice between you and some poor bastard whose wife you're about to make into a widow, brother, I will put you down. Because you didn't need to be there. You could have been a mailman. There's a flip side to that, Quinn. Let's say you have me boxed in, and I got to put you down. Because no matter what, you will not get in my way. But now that we've been face to face, I wouldn't feel good about that. But I wouldn't hesitate, not for one second. Maybe we'll play out like that. And maybe we'll never see each other again. Check. Sure.